Okay, guys, now we're going to go ahead and set up our toolbar. Um, this is going to be pretty easy, uh, but fairly complicated. So the first thing we're going to do is, um, in our coding here, we're going to go here, and we're going to type UL for unordered list, and LI. Um, we're going to start our unordered list here. Uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, set some links in here. A, ref. Um, put a pound sign because we don't have anywhere to link it to and we'll just say uh, item one close that space make an up and down line holding the shift key and the backslash button and we're gonna make another one uh, another pound sign uh, item two and that sh space shift hold down the backslash key again uh, we'll make uh, item three. Whoops. Pound. Then item three. Okay. So now what that did is it kind of stuck everything up here. What we're going to want to do is set this to a. Um, we're going to want to set a div class in here. So how we do that is fairly simple. I mean, it's not real hard. We're going to set, we're going to enter outside here. We're going to say uh, div ID or div uh, class, rather, um, toolbar. We're going to go to set the end here. Close the div class. Um, right now we have nothing in our CSS for this div class. So now what we need to do is come in here, period for div class, toolbar. Now we're going to want to set the margins uh, to zero and auto because we want this centered. We want the width to be 800 pixels or actually We'll, we'll set this um, width to, we'll say 300 pixels. Uh, and we'll align the text into the center of this. So we now have uh, this set up over here. Now, um, for the next part, we want to make sure that inside this class, there's no bullet. So we're going to period toolbar space ul space li we're just going to say list style none and that's going to take that bullet off there uh, which is awesome now we're also going to want to say these links um, we want toolbar a and we want these links to be like the same color as everything else so we'll say color white and we're going to say text decoration uh, to none. This is going to take the underline away from it. So there we go. Now we got these white. We got it white there. Um, now we can make it so these when you hover over it, it underline shows up. We'll look period toolbar a colon hover. Now we'll say text decoration underline. Close that. Now if you take your mouse and roll over them, you're going to get a little underline under there. Okay, now next thing we want to do is we want to set this just like we did at the beginning. We want to make sure that these margins in here are up in the corner. So it's going to be toolbar, asterisk, margin is zero, padding is zero. Okay. And uh, I'm running out of time, so we're going to make another video real quick, and we're just going to push these down. Um, basically, is what we're going to do. Then we're going to um, that'll be the end of it. So the next video will be real short, uh, but it's going to be uh, it's going to have to do it because I ran out of time. So uh, I only got five minutes. Uh, the next one will be about 30 seconds long. Uh, have a good one. Come back.